Hi, in this video we're going to go over the five key elements to a legitimate website. And now before I get into these, there's one thing I want to make clear. Obviously there are some websites out there that don't implement many or even all of these uh, elements and they have highly legitimate, highly authoritative, trusted websites. Craigslist is an excellent example of that um, and kind of an ugly site, a very basic site, um, but one of the most popular websites on the internet. So obviously you don't have to implement all of these um, techniques in order to become legitimate and authoritative but they really really help for a brand new site um, or just a newer site that just doesn't have a whole lot of traffic that doesn't have you know word of mouth that most of your visitors are first-time visitors never heard of your domain before so the goal is for those first-time visitors what can I do to show them hey this is a trusted legitimate website um, you should check out what I have to offer you could you should check out the products that I recommend etc etc that's going to both directly and indirectly increase your profits with your website so it is important that you have factors on your website that will increase that legitimacy and there are several things you can do and that's what we're going to get into here today so number one is branding. You don't have to have a brand again. That's some you know there are many sites out there that don't have a specific brand, and they're highly legitimate and they're perfectly fine. But this is one thing that you can do that will help um, for those first-time visitors coming to your website to show, hey, you know this is somewhat of an established website. Uh, you know they've put in the time to create a logo. They've uh, come up with a brand they have a, an actual brand it's not just a you know an exact match domain that they grab not that exact match match domains are in in themselves bad uh, but having just having that brand and that logo um, right away when the website opens they see that that just shows it kind of it's kind of like a a wrapper of a business it just kind of looks like you know this is actually a real legitimate business <clears throat> Uh, number two, professional, relevant media, videos, images, etc. Um, it just kind of lends to the uh, credibility. It adds to the topic. Again, it shows that time has been put into this. It's, this isn't just some, you know, low quality site that's been thrown together. Um, high quality, clear, nice looking, relevant images. They add to the visual aspect of the site, um, and they just help with your credibility. Um, number three, social media presence. Now this is something that won't particularly help you in the search engines, contrary to popular belief. Um, but if you'll notice, many sites that do well in the search engines are also active on social media. That's not a direct correlation. It just means if a website is popular um, in social media, a lot of times it'll end up getting a lot of natural backlinks and helping. But just having that for the viewer uh, more than anything else just to see hey you know this again this company this isn't just a, a website thrown out there they actually they're on Facebook um, they have people who have liked their page they're interacting with them etc and then they can go and like you and and get into that conversation and that community so it, it adds a community aspect to your website and shows that hey I'm not the only person visiting this website there are other people too so you know there is probably something to it um, you know, Facebook, Twitter, as many as you can, and different social media networks um, are more powerful and less powerful depending on the niche, um, demographics, etc. Credibility pages, or what I call credibility pages, and that is this right here. You see, <clears throat> we have an about page, contact, privacy, terms of use. These are just credibility pages. These aren't something that your viewers are going to, you know, focus in on, and and most of them aren't going to click it and and check them out. Um, but just seeing them, just glancing at them and seeing terms of use, privacy, contact about, that's credibility. You know, how many high quality, um, credible websites do not have a, an about page or a contact page or a privacy page? Hardly any of them. They, almost all of them have these pages. And again, it just shows that. Uh, you know, thought has been put into this website. Um, they just they're accustomed to seeing pages like this, so make sure you have those on there. And then just for the user experience, the user experience, and this is just kind of an extra uh, uh, side note. The user experience is also very important. You know, you want you don't want to give a bad impression. Um, normally, authoritative, um, trusted websites have good. Um, 
navigation and it's user friendly so just make sure your website is user friendly good navigation um, and you'll be good to go so those are the five key elements and again it's branding a branded logo using a brand in your title tag having a brand so the brand of this website is camp.com professional relevant media videos images they also help with SEO have relevant videos um, and images in as many of your of your posts as you can uh, number three is social media presence. Be active in a community. Um, show that it is a community of people who visit this website. You're not the only one. And then credibility pages. Contact about privacy, etc., etc. So I hope that helps. If you implement those five key elements, um, it will get you off to a good start in your niche and show that you are trusted and legitimate.